Yo, what is going on YouTube? Welcome to another trade review. And in today's review, we're going to be going over a 300% play that I had on QQQ. And I just wanted to start off by saying, if you do notice a little bit of static in my mic, it may be a little bit annoying. I do apologize for that. I do not know why that's happening. But with that being said, let's go ahead and get into the setup that I've seen here on QQQ that may be 300%. So let's just start off by going on the higher time frame, like 30 minute. This trade was actually like really, really textbook. This was a really, really, really solid trade. And a really easy trade to catch, especially with the way the market's been moving recently. Um, so if so, if we look at this 371.40 level here on QQQ, which I was watching for us to possibly come up to retest before taking any long positions, um, or uh, yeah, any long positions unless we got over that, obviously. But um, so yeah, as you can see, we've had one, two, three. Now make a fourth previous rejection at that uh three or uh, seventy one forty, so that makes it a really really strong uh resistance and supply zone. And I seen that, and um you know I was seeing us getting a rejection off here when the market opened, all those long wick top candles followed by this big bearish candle right here, pretty big bearish candle closing below VWAP. I actually got in above VWAP, which I usually don't do because that's that's actually against my trading strategy. But um it's actually against my trading strategy. But as you can see. You can pause the YouTube video here. I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna reread all this, but um, as you can see, somewhere in here, I was probably telling my Discord to watch that uh 371.40 area. I mean, if I didn't, uh, I mean at open, I was saying watching to see or watch to see what we do around this uh 371.40 area. I said if we can break and hold above VWAP and also low. Wait, if we can break and hold below VWAP and also low a day since open in that uh 369.63 level. I might can, uh, consider uh, getting into 367 puts. If you did get in 367 puts, even when we were directing off that key supply and resistance area at the top, you probably would have made a thousand percent if you held all day. I made 300 percent, like I said, but you easily could have made a thousand percent. And insane opportunities in this Discord. It is completely free. I will leave the link for the Discord in the YouTube description. Hope to see y'all in there because we give out bangers all the time. This is the only trade I took on Friday. It is currently Sunday. I'm recording this really late. But yeah, really, really, really solid trade. 300% as you can see here. Almost 1,000%. That was at 1.30 p.m. Might have went a little bit more. Not sure. Either way, it's really, really, really solid trade. And as you can see, um, I was also calling uh these levels too. Like um these levels that uh you know i had marked up my next you know support and demand zones were actually playing out as well in qqq um my main one was 366.01 was my main take profit as i was saying here all out take profit here hit uh sorry all out here take profit hit at 366.01 or almost hit sorry cannot read right now but either ways that was a very 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 solid trade very, very valid setup, especially uh, when we got that selling pressure coming in, that bearish momentum coming in, us falling below VWAP, us rejecting a v uh, key level. All those confluences added together, you know, um, really, really gave me confidence in this trade. And as you can see, this just played out beautifully. Really, really solid trade. It was a really, really good way to end the week. That was it for today's video. Uh, literally, we took one trade on Friday, 300%. Boom, we were done for the day. If you guys did enjoy this little review here, make sure to like and subscribe button. And I kind of have been slacking with the reviews like this week, like last week, I guess. Um, well, it's still this week. But um, we're back on it next week. Going to be doing a video every single day into YouTube Shorts every single day. Kind of had a lot going on last week. I was sick a day or two. Had some friends back in town and stuff like that. But enough, not enough uh, rambling on. Uh, like I said, if you guys did enjoy this YouTube video, make sure to like and subscribe button. And I hope to see you all in the Discord.